Well, we've bought some jacarandas. They're only small, so I thought I'd advance them in pots. It's getting on for autumn now. Uh, late summer, rather. It'll soon be autumn. They can grow indoors for the winter without losing their leaves, can't they? And by spring, we can plant them out at a good size. They'll probably be up here. They do grow quite fast anyway. There's still a growing season. It's only, what, February? There's still March and April to go. So that would be very nice. And, uh, yes, they're very drought resistant once established. They are. They are quite drought resistant once established. It's getting dark actually. I shouldn't film at this time of day. It's getting dark. But they are quite drought resistant once established. And they'll be beautiful. They will. This place will be like Pretoria in South Africa that's famous for its jacaranda leaves, uh, jacaranda trees. It's a big purple, uh, blue flower display every year. And I'll just get more, I'll get more and more. These are only two. I should get more and more over a period. I might buy some next week and the week after that, just a couple at a time. And just plant out more and more, put some in pots, advance some, put some in the ground too maybe. The main thing too is to uh, not let privets overtake them. I did uh, have an advanced uh, uh, jacaranda once before that was grown from a small one. I grew it very quickly in a garbage can. I drilled holes in the bottom of the, of the garbage can and uh, I filled it with soil and planted it out and it grew to an enormous height in the garbage can and then we put it in the ground and it was doing really well except privets sort of invaded and the privets took over and it sort of all got out of hand so I lost that jacaranda. But this time I won't let any privets near them. Indeed I've been thinking of putting some black plastic on the ground around them when I plant them out and uh, to stop any weeds at all and especially not privet and they should do well and they should turn into a beautiful jacaranda forest they should they really should they will well look it's about two or three weeks later and they've already grown they've grown what at least six inches and they're going to keep growing for the next month or so before autumn and then I'll bring them indoors. Look how much they've grown already. They're quite fast growers, aren't they? They are. That's really good. It's part of my plan to have a purple forest. That's all new growth, all that green growth. All that green growth is this year's growth since... Uh, yes, well it was only a couple of inches above the old wood, but now it's grown a lot. So is this one here. This one isn't quite as tall, but it's taking off too. And I can bring it indoors as a pot plant for the winter time. It's putting on lovely growth and it's so ferny too. It's so ferny and beautiful. They're both ferny and lovely. It's going to be really good. Let's get some more. Look, so lush and ferny. It's like a beautiful fern. Isn't it wonderful? Jacaranda fern. Wonderful. Cool and green. <laughs>